Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. I'm going to go um, just a quick little trip down the southwest, just me and the daughter. I uh, thought it would get a little bit light, but the problem is when you start packing, it never ends up being light. Um, got the car pretty well loaded up. I say, I think, well, I'm going to try minimalism, but that never tends to work. By the time you get some pillows, I mean, probably about 30 odd kilos worth of bloody firewood. Stick the tent on there. Load up the back with a couple of mats. Um, usually cutlery, crockery, all in there. Some lights, sleeping bags. No, time you do your tent pegs and everything else. Man, got a little bit in the drawers, but um, only they're just you know, sort of just keep tools around in those ones and sort of um, get a lucky gear, everything bags, sort of charger in there, sort of fire stuff, electrical gear. More things sort of right up the back. I do a um, thing with all the bags one day, but mainly use all the grab me gear stuff. Um, good quality, I say, you can put it all away. A couple more in there. So I usually have um, a sort of my coffee bag, and that's sort of incidentals. Um, a lot we sort of take away the sort of bug sprays. Suntan lotions and that one, the pink one I know, because it used to carry all the doors like sort of the Nurofens and Panadols, and sort of tablets in there, um, throat disinfectant and stuff like that. So, a bit of water, stove, like I said the bags and everything else. She's um, she's pretty well loaded, but. That's right, it's all got a home, all packs in nicely, fridge is loaded up, and that's the main thing. So, so we'll start heading away, um, pick her up after school, and I say just a quick couple nights down to um, Potter's Gorge in Collie, just a little bit of camping, um, get the fire cranked up, and have a couple of decent nights. Thanks guys, we'll see you soon. Hey all, just um, driving down the highway, hopefully be at campsite probably in about an hour. Welcome back to Hi. the co-pilot. Hello. <laughs> I'm playing my game. So yeah, she's playing a game. It's called Heroes Charging. <laughs> it's a really good game. Every time I come down here, go to the old Amy Bakehouse. I'll see if they're open. I think they are. Should be. We'll see what they have. They've got all these pretty funky kangaroos. Yeah. Down here as well. Climb over the and the thing, we'll go have a look at I them shortly. The like I say, they've got a um, bit of kangaroo. Out here, you can have a bit of a walk through. <laughs> Dad. Look at the different type of kangaroos. There you go. There you go. Show everyone what a Mr. Happy is. <laughs> there you go. Mr. Happy keeps them happy. Yeah, it's a nice little stopover. Just on your way through, probably about 60 k's north of Bunbury. Grab yourself something to eat. Yeah, at Miami Bakehouse. Hello everyone, we've just arrived at Potter's Gorge. Yes, uh, and you, the last video you've seen is probably of Potter's Gorge. <laughs> no, I was actually... Uh, I haven't uploaded an Exmouth one yet. We did Exmouth. Yes, we went to Exmouth. We did. And so. Dad will upload it as soon as he edits it. Ah. Because he's just a bit lazy. <laughs> so we'll be going to our campsite. It's fairly quiet. 
at the moment. This is going to get chock a block, I would think, over the weekend. There's a couple of puddles around the place. These ones in their 20s. Um, we're staying at 39. Yay! Yes, thank you, Mr. GPS. Oh. You know why that's beeping? Beep! You, you haven't got your seatbelt on. Just put it on so get rid of that stupid beep. <laughs> Sorry, guys! <laughs> that's yeah. better. Thanks kindly. So we we'll come around here, usually down the other way there's the overflow. Up there, and a couple of campers around the place. Not many. It's a, a sort of picnic area that way. <laughs> yeah, wood suck. <laughs> yeah, wood suck. Alright, that's 36. 37 up there and 39 so that's us here yay i'm gonna yay i took my seatbelt off explore. thanks kindly <laughs> there he is ah. the mega wood duck of the year I think I might, robbie i might put my tent here interview Actually, campfire there. Do you like Potter's Gorge? I do. I like Potter's Gorge very what much. What do you like doing in your free time? Me? Going to Potter's Gorge. Do nah, you camp? I like camping. How many marshmallows do you toast? I like camping and exploring. How many marshmallows are stuffed in your belly right now? <laughs> Can you get off this, please? Okay. <laughs> Here he is, moving the table thing of a jig. Well, I'm thinking I'm actually putting the. <laughs> it's an earthquake, guys! It's an earthquake! It's an earthquake, Dad! Look, it's an earthquake! <laughs> Dad, it's an earthquake! <laughs> okay. Oh, now the fun bit setting up. <laughs> so. This is going to be uh, camp. So we got the else tent set out. The bed's just getting made up. And the car sorted. And the gear. Fire. Oh, oh, we'll stack that up very that shortly. Firewood? I got that firewood for Dad. Free yeah. firewood. I oh, know, sometimes people leave firewood, which is very nice. So, yeah, we're pretty well there. We'll just get a couple of chairs and we're going to enjoy the night. <laughs> well, good morning on this fine and misty, chilly morning. I'm going to crank up the fire, do a bit of breakfast, a little bit of um, chew on everything. Brings in a little bit. Damn, packed up the chairs, but they're not bad. Everything's misty morning. Never mind, that's what camping's all about. Beautiful morning though, it's got a bit of brisk to it. Do up the fire, warm up, cook a bit of food. But um, they're the um, long drops through there. Daughter's still in bed. It's 40. There's a little bit of fog through there. Beautiful though. Not a breath of air. Really nice. Good sleep. Fire cranking. We've got a little friends come in. 28s, always bring them a little bit of seed. Around the place.
Hey, little fella. Oh, I've got the sun breaking through. Woods. Beautiful. My little mates having a breakfast. Around the place. And that's what we're going to be doing shortly. You're nice and warm. I'm playing another one of my games. It's <laughs> a police game. <laughs> I'll put the hot plate on. And it can and just show you how bad I am at drawing. And we'll cook a bit of brekkie. Can I show you my drawing? Can I show them my drawing? Oh, there you go. Shows you how bad I am at drawing. <laughs> Big Larry. <laughs> You're a wood duck. Alright, bacon and eggs. And a couple of hashy browns on the go. Hushy browns. Hushy browns. Hushy browns. We'll get some eggs and bacon happening shortly. Just a couple of little cuts. And I'll get my little egg cuppers off. Get this on the go. It'll be good. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Yummy, yummy. In my tummy, tummy, tummy. And the egglets. <laughs> Is that bird behind me? <laughs> yeah, it was. What are you guys doing now? What? No. That one. I have to get my little hash brown for the birds. Oh! Hash brown thief! <laughs> Next most important meal. Ha! <laughs> Coffee. That's stainless steel one, I can do it on the fire, but um, while I've got it here, this might be easier to... Just take the milk a little bit. Coffee going. And yeah, this little fella. Gives it a mix and stirs it around for you. Uh, there we go. Golden goodness. Yum yum. Turn that off. Is it ready to go? Nice bit of froth. This one be peaking shortly. It starts to oversaturate. Yeah. And give the cup a warm. So that oh. 
Oh, that's camp. We have. Oh, well, you can see that one. That's that um, light I was talking about. Sits up the, the top there. I'll pull it down a little bit later. But it's got a, um, a spike you go into, a dimmer switch, and it's just connected up. Got a couple of things connected up, running off the battery box sitting in there. So we'll pull it in point two. That one there, just got. Um, I bought a lithium for the car, which is sitting in there, in the back there. And I got a little 54 amp hour lithium because I had 20% off at iTech World as well. Just for camp, just for charging up phones. The thing weighs about 7 kilos, next to nothing. The battery box is huge for it though. I'll pull it out um, sometime later and do a little bit of a review on it. But um, there's just sort of a couple of the bags. The bags up through there, and just for boxes. Um, that one, top one, usually has got the fire stuff. Bottom one's got all the cooking utensils. And that one's got all glasses, cups, chopping boards, everything in there. So that's the usual stuff that comes away with us. Here we go. I usual thing that comes away. <laughs> so. Sun's just um, coming through, so we're um, on the campsites. Like I said it's pretty empty here at the moment. I'm going for a bit of a wander. All of them, all the sites here, they've all got um, camp table and a fire pit and sort of grate. There's no water or power, and it's fifteen dollars a night. For adults and I think three three for kids so two of us it costed 18 bucks I think 36 bucks for two nights which isn't bad um, these are the long drops nice and clean um, they've got a little bit of water through there it's not drinkable it's just usually a bit of ball or rain water yeah, just give you a look inside here but like I said, they're nice and uh, nice and clean, all well looked after. Everything else. There's a couple of these strewn through the place. Like I said, it's um, pretty empty at the moment. We'll go for a bit of a walk down to the dam later on. There's probably only about maybe I don't know, half a dozen campers around the place. Um, I think tonight there'd be a few more coming in. Going for a wander. A wander, wander. Just in the evening. We'll go have a look at um, cut through the dam. Yeah, then I'll be on the roll and Dad will go back and I'll be still wandering out a bit. Oop. Only came a gutsa. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's nice down here. Just on, uh, just coming on evening. The sun just about to go down, probably about an hour left or thereabouts. Here we are, sun's just going down now. And slipping over the tree line. That's why the sort of clouds are sitting over the top there's pretty cool. Well good morning and as luck would have it, it's pack up day 
and the rain gods will certainly give us their blessing. So there's going to be a, a whack old wet old pack up. But that's alright, that's camping. Everything's certainly nice and dry. Just started to get everything together, load up, everything's super dry in there. Hi. <laughs> Welcome. But yeah, she's uh, she's a wet old day. But that's all right. But the flies, um, if you ever do these Oz tents, for cheap investment, get one of these flies. Takes a little bit of effort to put them out there, but as far as rain and condensation, I mean, we had a couple nights, it was probably about two degrees, and um, we had nothing. It was really good. So, yeah, well, the plan is. I'll pack up as much as what I can. The tent will go last. Um, I've got a little bit of a break in the weather. Then we'll load up and we'll grab a bit of cereal. We'll probably grab a coffee on the road. And we head all back. So, that's alright. Until the next time. <laughs> See you guys. Thanks for tuning in.